Hi guys, this is the second video in our series on how to start your own online business in 2024. And this is really to urge you and encourage you to get started with your online business in 2024. This could be a great way for you to get started, to fund your move abroad, but also to actually sustain your lifestyle once you move abroad. There are different ways you can sustain your lifestyle abroad, but having your own online business is my preferred way, okay? Because it's fully independent, it only depends on you, not on an employer or something else, okay? So that to me is the best way to get to sustain your lifestyle abroad. So having your own online business is a great way for you to free up your finances because you don't really have a limit on how much money you can make. You decide on how much money you want to make because you decide on the prices you set for your services, okay? And it's obviously location independent. These are two key important factors when owning your own online business location independence, as well as financial independence, okay? Now, in a previous video, I mentioned that maybe your doubt is around what kind of business idea you should get started with. Well, first of all, I'm going to walk you through the process of choosing your best business idea. I'm going to do that in a free five-day challenge. It's a free challenge that I've hosted before, and I'm hosting it again for free, five days together in a private Facebook group. All you have to do is sign up for it in the description of this video again five days where I'm going to walk you through the process of figuring out what your business idea should be and how to actually launch your online business in just 30 days. But for the sake of this video today, I wanted to give you a little tips on how to get started with your online business as well. One easy thing that you can do when it comes to figuring out what kind of business you should launch is really looking at what's around you. What is the existing need? Every business is actually an answer to a need. It could be a very serious need or it could be a shallow need, okay? But really a business is an answer to a problem. So be observant. What are the things that you personally struggle with or maybe the things that you have solved and people around you are still struggling with? Maybe you're really good at math and you see that a lot of kids around you struggle with math. What about starting a business that resolves that specific problem? Maybe you're really good at finances or maybe you got out of a very bad situation with your credit and you finally pay out your student loans and you have $50,000 in credit card debt. Well, guess what? If you've done that, maybe you can teach other people how to do that as well. Maybe that's your business idea right there because a lot of people are still struggling with that. So there is an existing need that you can answer to. As easy as that, this is how you can get started with your own online business answering a specific existing need. That's all. In the next video, I'm gonna tell you a little more about what is required in terms of tech to start your own online business. And you'll be surprised by how little it takes to get started and to grow your own online business. So if you like this video, make sure you give it a like, share it with a friend, and of course, subscribe to the channel, that way you don't miss any of my other videos in this series. And of course, join us for the free challenge. The information is in the description of this video. Until next time, bye.